Well, this is a shocker. I just came back to do another video now. It's now 5.47, about to be 5.48 in just a moment in the, in the evening. And uh, John Swan deleted his Twitter account. Yeah, I'm just yeah, I'm just as shocked as you are. John Swan deleted his Twitter account because after he the apology, I guess he couldn't take another look on his Twitter account with all the people DMing him or tweeting at him to which some of the people have accepted accepted his apology and some have didn't. I really don't understand why John would have to do that. I mean, you apologize. There's no reason for you to delete your Twitter account. There's no reason. You could have just left it up. You said you were you were gonna be away for a while. That doesn't mean you have to delete your account. No one's asking you to do that. Nobody is asking you to do that, John Swan. Why did you fucking delete your account? You made a perfectly good apology that you lied to all of us. And you decide to leave just like that? Leave Twitter? Literally leave Twitter by deleting your account? Look, I'm going to say this right now. If you're making... If any of you in the future are making a Twitter account, don't bother deleting. You need to face it head on. You need to face the criticism that you got head on and and you also need to be forgiven by some, some other people who are going to forgive you. Leave your Twitter open. Don't delete it out of nowhere because you were this much stressed out about this. Don't do that because you just made a perfectly good apology. If you delete your Twitter and you made an apology right before you deleted it, then that would just make me think that the apology that that you made hours earlier was also a lie. So don't delete your Twitter fucking account. It's just wrong for you to do that. It's wrong for you to delete your existence out of nowhere. All you could have just done is to delete the app and log off your computer. Deleting your account is... <sighs> it's a waste of history being ripped to shreds. The only reason people would, would use Twitter, Twitter is to have a legacy on there. And if you delete your own legacy, then, then it's not going to make much sense for you to rebuild your entire legacy back up. Now what? Just don't do that. Don't create a Twitter account and then delete it like what? three years, four years later, or a month later, if you have Twitter for a month, don't delete it. Keep it. You have a legacy on Twitter. Just because your legacy is tarnished a little bit doesn't mean you should delete it. Don't delete it after you made a perfectly good apology. That's just wrong.
even Harley TBS kind of figured this out. He tweeted this, really? Fucking really? I mean, yeah, come on, John Swan. <sighs> when you make an apology to the entire commentary community for lying harshly about Dream, the last thing you should never do is to do your entire Twitter account. I know you said somewhere along the lines that you were going to leave social media, but that doesn't mean you need to actually delete your fucking Twitter account. All you need to do is do what Call Me Carson did and just delete the app, which I think you should have done only delete the app, not the account. And log off the the Twitter website, not delete the Twitter account on the website. And and then you're 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 go from there. Like, come on. I mean come on. You can't be doing this type of shit. You can't be doing the deletion of your entire account, like, literally. If you say you're going to leave social media, deleting the app and logging off the internet is actually more uh, prominent rather than, like, deleting your entire account. That just makes you look like a fool now. Because now I'm not going to know if your apology was actually sincere. And another thing, if you delete your tweets, like every single time, and I don't care if it's a DMCA issue, grow the fuck up and own up to it. Grow the fuck up and keep the tweets up. Don't delete your tweets. It'll make you look like a jackass. I just can't stand people who like to delete their own accounts. For what reason do you have to delete your account? Keep the legacy up. No reason for you to, to delete. I know Twitter has these weird rules about when, about why people leave their Twitter accounts for like more than six months and then after that they do this verification thing after you come back like more than six months later, and then you have to file this thing on the on the phone or on like your email to verify your account that you're going to be active on there. And you know what? That I probably get if you don't want to do that, if you're going to delete your account, but still. You have a legacy on Twitter. We all have a legacy on Twitter. There is no reason for you to delete your account. Especially when you just made that apology. John Swan, I cannot forgive you for this now. You completely deleted an apology tweet. To everyone. (sighs) I swear, if you don't revive your account back in time for your vacation, or back in time during your vacation, oh, I'm going to be very, very, very extremely pissed. So fucking bring your account back up right now, John Swan. Can't be doing this shit.